Now, the, uh, working with funder, uh, funders or investors is a longer finance team recruitment process because, of course, a project will take six to nine months. So instead of me knowing within four days, oh, mate, <laughs> they just can't make a phone call <laughs> or they're making a phone call every four minutes <laughs> and doing nothing in between, um, I will find out their behaviour within six to nine months. It's a bit painful at times and don't let it put you off but just be conscious that this stuff happens so one of the things that we were talking about andy is early doors ash and i made i think it's here here we are we we made a little spreadsheet of investor analysis and we did this like 18 months ago tiff two years ago and this is because we'd worked with investors for about three or four years by that point we'd started to see repeating behavior some of it fantastic but fantastic and some of it a little bit frustrating so can i read out to you the criteria by which we started to analyze our current investor database note there's nothing about money so do they pay on time or i suppose that is money are they polite to my team because everyone's going to be nice to me so i ignore that are they nice to my team who don't matter my team do matter um, but they may have a per perception my team don't matter. Are they respectful of our work and our time? Are they efficient? Do they, think, do, they do things fast and efficient? Um, do they add to TGPC? You know, are they positive? Do they volunteer? We're not asking for loads, but are they basically positive? Or do they, are they a right moan bag? <laughs> to be quite honest with you, that's the official term. Um, do they have the basic understanding and knowledge of how property works and that it's variable? So that they've got an appetite for when things go wrong, can they ride the, the wave? And also, are we going to spend hours explaining really the fundamental basics that they need to have gone elsewhere, got educated before they work with us as investors? We don't need them to be extremely knowledgeable, but we do not want to be working uh, based teaching them the basics because actually that's not efficient for us. Are they a nice character? Seriously, that's one of our criteria. Have they done a deal and are they compliant with 13.3? Now, in the middle of recruiting my funding team, which is where we're at right now, we've got the big bulb, you know, and we're going to have some bumps with some people. Next year, we close our investor group uh, to new investors in December just gone, which means that by December 2016, we're only going to work with between five and ten people and they're, only, they're all going to score five out of five on this or we won't work with them. So do you see how ultimately we, we're not actually judging it on money, we're judging it on can we both have a good time working together, is really what we're saying. Now, I would hope that we would behave in exactly the same way to our investors, and I'd be very upset if we weren't respectful of their time, their money, you know, speaking nicely to them and all the rest of it.